it would be a great relief for most people that are single parents. And once you have a child who's diagnosed with some sort of sickness, it would be a great financial help for people who are, who are single parents and are struggling to make end meet. It would be a great help for single parents. Well, it is good that he's doing that for the people. It is very good. I'm real happy for that. It's a good idea because they have some, some parents that can't afford day-to-day -day necessities. So it will be a good help to the children. If they get sick. Yes, they can go to a health facility or is it in regards to medication. Mm -hmm. It's a very good idea and it, it's very good. That would be so nice because I have a lot of single parents as I said earlier. Really can't afford, you know? So I can stop so they were glad for that, a little help. Yeah. Medication. Yeah, medication and whatever friends that I get. It would be so nice. Okay. So nice of my president. Right now, health overall, going to do a checkup is really expensive. Persons don't want to go to public hospital because they're saying it's problems, they gotta wait too long and so on. So the health voucher is really good as you know, the same initiative with the health voucher is really good to me. When you're a single mother, trust me, a lot of things you can't afford. And um, now these days when you gotta work in the, not all private sector offer um, health benefits, right? So a, mother, a single mother working in a private sector that don't offer health benefits, Right, so this will, this will definitely help them. At least it, it, it will go away, yes, in helping certain things. God, there are still certain places you can go and, you know, get a checkup and so I might not be much that you have to put, but I still think it's a really good initiative, at least for a start. Oh, that's a great idea because, you know, we got single mothers, we got single fathers that acting as single mothers. We also have single mothers that playing a role in a household for both father and mother. So the government helping them would be very nice and very helpful. So thank you to the government again. Well, well that is great. And um, in the sense, uh, people can understand that these vouchers and grants is not only about accepting the sum. Is about making sure that it's, it's, it's used for the purpose it was given for, you know. And honestly, God is on my side with health is concerned. So none of my kids have no health issues, you know. And so I wouldn't be naive in the fact of thinking that, oh, I'd be missing out. But those persons who have health issues, you know, it's a plus. Don't look at the amount, but it's something to start you, you know. And we, we as a people, I think since I return home, you know, we have to accept things that is coming towards us. And I've been saying it over and over that we will have a day that sometimes things will be coming to us. And I thank God I'm alive now to see a lot of stuff happening and it's coming to us. And we gotta be grateful as a people.